back to my channel thank you for tuning in so today i have this curly full face makeup tutorial for you guys i thought it was perfect for the springtime it has been absolutely beautiful down here in new york city it is so sunny the weather is nice and warm it's not so freezing cold so i thought this look was perfect being the spring is here and summer is right around the corner who doesn't want to wear corals and pinks and nudes i absolutely love them for spring and summer this makeup is so easy to achieve you actually only need two eyeshadows a quick tip for you lovelies being that i am doing a coral makeup tutorial i used a coral blush i used the be mad city color blush in the color fresh melon which is a beautiful matte coral color of course if you guys don't have any orangey corally eyeshadows it is perfectly fine just grab your blending brush and grab a little bit of the blush and apply it to your crease that is all i didn't use my blush as my eyeshadow in this video because i actually do have an uh, orangey eyeshadow but i have done this before where i don't have either a pink eyeshadow or i don't have a coral eyeshadow i will use my blush just add a little bit to your blending brush and blend it onto your crease and that's it it's you might not even need two eyeshadows you probably just need one and then you need your blush which is gonna work as an eyeshadow as well so if you guys are interested in seeing how i got this really easy to achieve coral peachy makeup look then please just keep watching so as always i'm gonna go in with my favorite combination which is a covergirl 3-in-1 foundation and this tarte amazonian clay smooth operator it gives an awesome finish to the face i just love it for spring because it just gives this like nice glowy finish to your skin and I'm just gonna apply this with my round top cookie brush. Now for concealer, I'm using my NYX HD concealer and I'm just gonna apply this right under my eyes so I can cover my dark circles. And to highlight, I'm going in with the Maybelline H Rewind in the color Neutralizer. I'll make sure to list all the products down below, guys, because there are some of them that I can't really remember the names to. So I'm just going to highlight. I'm going to apply this under my eyes in a triangular shape. I'm going to apply this on the bridge of my nose, on my forehead. I'm applying a little bit right above my eyebrows so I can give it a highlight on my chin and on my cupid's bow. And of course, let's blend this because we don't want anything to have any harsh lines. To set this concealer and highlight, I'm going in with my e.l.f. HD setting powder. And for contour, I'm going in with my Bobbi Brown bronzing powder in the color natural. I absolutely love this powder. This has to be my favorite, favorite bronzer. And I'm going in with my large dual fiber brush and just blend this all together. For blush, I'm going in with my City Color Beat Matte Blush in the color Fresh Melon. I'm just going to dust this on my cheeks. And for a nice highlight, I'm going in with this Maybelline Master Studio Highlight in the color Nude. I absolutely love this product. I'm going to apply this to the highest points of my cheekbones, down the bridge, bridge, I'm sorry, down the bridge of my nose, my cupid's bows. Now, as for my eyes, I'm going in with my e.l.f. lid primer. And I'm going to go in with my Bobbi Brown um, palette and I'm using an eyeshadow from the palette. I'll make sure to list it down below because I can't remember the name of it. And I'm just gonna blend this right on my crease. This is a beautiful orangey color. It's just perfect for the spring and the summer. And I'm going in for my BH Cosmetics Special Location Palette. And I'm just gonna grab this nude kind of all over the lid color. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna apply it all over my lid.
Now I know this is just real fast, but I was so out of focus. But I did my winged eyeliner for my CoverGirl eyeliner, and I'm gonna go in for my two favorite mascaras, my L'Oreal, both of them L'Oreal Carbon Black and then Voluminous Carbon Black. Don't forget to coat those bottom lashes. To brighten up the eye a little bit, I'm adding the Rimmel Scandalize in the color Nude to my waterline. To line my lips, I'm using a lip liner by I don't know who, I'm sorry, but it's in the color Mango. It's a beautiful corally pinky color. I'm just lining my lip with, lips with that. And I'm going to go in with my Anne Juliet lipstick by Jessie's Girl. This is a very beautiful orangey um very bright orangey corally color i think it's gorgeous but it was just a little too bright for me so to tone it down i added and cleopatra by jesse's girl as well over the top and i just blended this together to give it a more peachy corally look and to top off my lipsticks i added my nyx butter lip gloss in the color apple strudel Don't forget to comment if you guys have any requests or any questions and please 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 subscribe so that is it for today's video thank you guys so much for tuning in and i'll see you guys in my next video Ciao.